If you are a man and you've been wondering why money seems to be harder for men, if you are a lady and there's a man in your life and you've actually been wondering how come he doesn't get, seem to settle on this subject of money. There are actually five distinct areas that tends to explain why money is hard for men. And the number one reason is because of the societal expectations and it's easily sounded on a woman wallet. And a man without money maybe feels a bit problematic or feels a bit disabled. And that's generally very common in our Kenyan society. To avoid people feeling like you're not complete. You know, avoid these titles. Men end up doing all sorts of things to get money. From gambling, doing odd jobs, sometimes even stealing, or taking up loans. Many men end up living this perpetual dissatisfied life never satisfied with what they already have, always hoping to get something more. You know, comparing with peers, classmates, neighbors, siblings, colleagues at work, actually as a man, have you felt this compulsive, competitive force within yourself that sometimes gets you to wake up at night or to dare to do things that really you would not have done? And I think this is why we like challenging men and we like saying they need to be proactive. So that you're not reactive to society because the society will always keep raising the bar and sometimes they raise the bar well above where you need to be so sometimes it is not necessary that we get to that a point of where the society raises the bar and they raise it very high let's look at the second reason why money is hard for men because naturally for some reason men have a high risk propensity Men are generally risk takers. Just look at the games they love. You know, the hard games. You know, you look at sumo, wrestling, football. And this is whether they are fans or whether they are participants. They've been wired with hormones that tend to give them more adrenaline, more joy when they face some amount of risk. That high risk propensity makes money difficult for men because they seem to need more all the time they seem to blow what they have within a short time. And there's not, nothing to worry about that. That's your nature. Maybe what we just need to do is to learn how to have a balance. So that's an important aspect that we can look at. The other reason why money gets hurt to men is because naturally they are competitive. They will always fear missing out. So if all my friends are going to Naivasha, it doesn't matter. I will look for the money. Even if it means to go to the mobile lenders, the Shiro. And men have what is called the drum major instinct, the super ego, the id, very, very pronounced in men. Every man wants to lead the parade, he wants to be the winner, drive the bigger car, live in the bigger house, live on top of the hill, just have the most beautiful girl, have a lovely family. That competition comes with a price. And we have to pay that price when we find money can be had. But sometimes it doesn't count where it comes from. The number four item is men are not good at asking direction. I don't know if you agree with me. Men will get lost for not asking directions. Women will ask direction all the time. They sometimes even want to try when they have no idea what is it. And you know, when they lose, they don't want to own up their loss. Put it in. They stay with it. And maybe it's time that men got to ask direction on money matter. And we're going to see what are the avenues available for them to actually ask for direction. And they are simple things. You can take your time and maybe get a book and read. There are many financial books that you can read. You can enroll for a program. And I'm going to talk about a program here. Maybe in your investment group, you can have a time with your buddies in the investment group. When you simply talk business ideas, not in the pub, not your drinking buddies, serious people who come to the table and discuss business. Maybe it might be important to have a mentor, somebody you can go to and sound off your ideas. Yes, if you've got a good girl in your life, maybe sometimes comparing notes with her. can be your girlfriend, can be your wife, can be your sister, can be your mama. Somebody who will help you to sound out your idea just before you dive in. And that's a very important aspect so that 
don't get lost if you can ask for direction. The fifth reason why money gets hard for men is because men generally have the fear for old age neglect. And sometimes they say, let me enjoy when I can. After all, I am only counting now. When I don't count, I don't count. You know what they say? Man is just like the caterpillar. They use it to mow the trees, clear the ground, level the road, even help in tarmacking the road. But when the road is finally done, they put it on a truck and transport it. Doesn't use that good road. That happens for a lot of men. They build a whole infrastructure, send the children to school, build a family estate, and eventually, when they get old, maybe the children gone away. Their mother goes to visit them for six months. The man is left alone, and that all day negri that men fear sometimes get them to say, "I will leave now when I can. When I can't, I can't. Now I count. Let me get it done." It's a common theme you will hear a lot of times with men. But let's agree, men, that you don't have to neglect yourself because others have neglected you. And so, if you actually get your time and you organize yourself, you can actually be able to overcome. Those reasons and money will not be hard for you. And if you actually need help, you can always get in touch. And I know at the Personal Finance Academy, we have a couple of programs, and we even have testimonials of fellow men who have really gained by engaging the Wealth Creation Masterclass. You can actually come in for a free session. It's called a Come and See, and you join in virtually online, and you get to learn. Send your name to zero seven zero eight one five zero. 137 0708 150 137